Welcome back to Assassin's Creed Revelations. Uh, the story has gotten really intense with some twists that I didn't see coming in the in the last part. Uh, now we have to rush to end up saving Sophia from the Templar's grasp. This may very well be the last video in the series. There may be one more, but we are coming towards the end, I believe, because this is sequence 8 and there's a total of 9 sequences. So this may very well be the last video in the series. I'm very excited to see where the story is heading, but I'm also scared at the same time to see what's going to become of Ezio because this is the last game in his trilogy. As always, guys, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a like, comment below what you enjoyed about it, what you may have done differently as well, and let's get into it. We're going to head over to the next memory marker now, which will be the first memory in the eighth sequence. Where we left off in the previous video, there was... A herald of some sort at the docks when we first came back to Constantinople stating that if anyone's got any information on the whereabouts of Etio Adetore that the people will receive 10,000 Akje for for um, some information now I should probably also be looking for a blacksmith let's have a quick look because I gotta repair my armor quite a bit of damage in the caverns in the caves and it looks like there's one here so let's go to that one first before we let's go to that one first before we go to the mission marker oh, might as well unlock the tailor as well all right 13,000 actually every 20 minutes Thanks, assassins. All right, let's talk to the herald and get our awareness down. Perfect. Now, let's continue on. I will just uh, get out of your way. Forgive my insignificance. As in, for a master assassin, the moment that you just slightly bump into someone is just toppling over. <laughs> All right, so repair everything. Let's have a look to see if there's any more armor that we can get to. Yeah. Sapahi riding braces. Oh, look at that. How much is it? 10,000. Okay. I mean, they look pretty good. Let's start with the chest guard. And then let's move on to the spaulders. And I think that that's going to be about it for now. Yeah, we're down to 600 Akje. Alright, no worries. Um, okay, let's crack on to the mission. It won't be too far away from here. And is it just me or is there a lot more Genisaris out on the streets as well now? Probably because there's a price on Ezio's head, I guess. And the assassins are hanging about. Has that, have they always been hanging around? Or is it because of Sophia, the threat to Sophia? Alright, well, let's find out. Discovery. Prince Ahmed has threatened to harm Sophia, find and protect her. If attacked, kill five guards in close combat without getting hit. Okay. Let's see if we can do that. Find Sophia. First of all, oh wait, I can't even equip anything. Alright. Oh, I can hear some grunting. Examine the body. Is that Yusuf? No. A knife in the back, seriously? You 
have earned your rest, brother. Requiescat in pace. Oh, man. Brothers, sisters, the whole city rises against us. While Yusuf's murderer waits and watches from the arsenal, laughing. Fight with me, and show him what it means to cross the assassins. I didn't expect that with Yusuf. I mean, I was hoping not to find Sophia's dead body, but then seeing Yusuf like that, he's just caught up. There's always got to be someone who's caught up. Find and kill Ahmed. Alright, use LB for your assassin signal. Get the axe out. Alright. Come on, brothers and sisters. Let's do this. Use the fine dudes in gold. Oh. I like this arrow swarming without losing. My dudes, the Templar status is now aware. Yeah, be aware. Oh, sorry, my guy. Didn't mean to hit you. Alright. Let's see if we can get our uh, full sync. I feel as though the assassins are going to take down these people straight away. Objective completed. Awesome. All right, I'm done with you guys. Let's go. Come on, Ahmed. Where is she? <laughs> Such fury. Where is she? If you think you are in a position to negotiate, kill me and be done with it. What a dirtbag. I am sorry it had to come to this. Two men who should be friends, quarreling over the keys to a library. We both strive for the same end, Ezio. Only our methods differ. Do you not see that? Peace, stability, a world where men live without fear. People desire the truth, yes. But even when they have it, they refuse to look. How do we fight this kind of ignorance? Liberty can be messy, Ahmed, but it is priceless. Of course. And when things fall apart, and the lights of civilization dim, Ezio Auditore can stand above the darkness and say proudly, I stayed true to my creed. That's all right. I will open that library. And I will find the Grand Temple. And with the power that is hidden there, I will destroy the superstitions that keep men divided. Not in this life, Ahmed. Not if we've got anything to say about it. Power when you are ready. Do this, and Sophia will be spared. Oh, shit. My brother's army will Excuse be here my soon, French. Ezio. After that, everything changes. So is Suleiman in, in on it too? How long have you been here? Long enough. I had Ahmed tailed as soon as he returned. But I never expected to hear all this. And what do you think? He is a sincere man. 
But this Templar fantasy of his is dangerous. It flies in the face of reality. The world is a tapestry of many colors and patterns. A just leader would celebrate this, not seek to unravel it. He fears the disorder that comes from difference. That is why we make laws to live by. A kanun that applies to all in equal measure. Shastadem! Stand back! Hold, soldier! This man is not our enemy. What a challenge it would be to have a son like you. You are not dead yet, old friend. Ezio. All right. Spare my uncle if you can. So he's on Ezio's side. Father? Oh. No. Mate, the guy is... He's lost. Alright, full sync. And... Let's grab this loot box while we're at it. And let's head over to the next quest marker. This is getting... Sick. This is getting intense. Jeez, look at the... Dead soldiers all over the ground. We might as well loot them and see if we can get some... Staff crossbow bolts, medicine. How much medicine have we got? Six. Alright, yeah, we need more. Medicine. Okay. So all the rest of the bodies have gone. There's... Ooh. Let's go... Let's go kill that guy so we can get our uh, awareness down. Where did he go to? Where did he go? He was right here. Alright, anyway, doesn't matter. Let's head on over to the next quest marker. If we come across a herald, then we'll jump over to the herald. This is... Very interested to see where the story's gonna go to. I didn't expect to find Yusuf like that. I thought that it would have been... Like, as in... <laughs> You gonna shoot me, huh? Watch what's gonna happen to you, bruv. You can shoot me all you like. But you were taken down. Alright. As I was saying, with Yusuf, there's always gonna be collateral damage, but man, you wouldn't think that someone who's helped you from the get-go is gonna be one of them. So it just begs the question of what's waiting now as Sophia's fate. Let's go, you want some? Stop that man! That was a heavy takedown. Alright, so it looks like we need to get our awareness down to zero in order for it to completely go away because the entire HUD is red at the moment. And without there being another messenger to kill, probably not going to go down anytime soon because I don't see any heralds. The exchange. Collect the massive keys and deliver them to armor to save Sophia. Rescue Sophia before she loses 50% health. Eesh. I hope they're not going to end up in their position. As in you get that he wants to save Sophia. However, it's a pretty big price to pay.
Mentor? Now should be a time for remembrance and mourning, I know. But our enemies do not permit us that luxury. Yusuf thought highly of you, assassin. And I find no reason to second-guess this judgment. Do you have it in your heart to lead these men and women, and to maintain the dignity of our order, as Yusuf did with such passion? It would be an honor. Bene, I am glad. Our enemy is close. Take positions around the tower, and wait for my command. Come on, let's do this. Alright, so meet with Ahmed and complete the exchange. Alright, so there's another guy here to execute. Let's get him done first. Come on, come to your death. Alright, good. Awareness is down to zero. Now let's crack on. Where is she? I admire you, Ezio. But your bloodlust makes it hard to call you a friend. Bloodlust? A strange insult from the man who ordered an attack on his own nephew. He was to be kidnapped, Ezio. Not killed. I see. Kidnapped by the Byzantines so that his uncle could rescue him and be heralded the hero. More or less. <laughs> now, the deception. The keys. Not gonna be that easy. <laughs> She's all yours. Oh. Uh. Sophia! Oh Tell no. Back off. She's all yours. Climb the tower and rescue Sophia. Two minutes. Oh, this is intense, man. That's not even her. No. No. You can see the assassins are jumping from rooftop to rooftop, taking everyone down. That's pretty sick. Come on. Come on, Sophia. Stay alive. Stay alive. 50% health. Oh, we got her. Are you hurt? The chills. Not, not hurt, but very confused. I did not mean to drag you into this. I am sorry. And you are not responsible for the actions of other men. All this will be over soon, but I need to recover what they have taken. I do not understand what is happening, Ezio. Who are these men? Run! Let's go. Uh... Oh man, that was intense. I thought for sure that she was going to die.
End of the road. Ahmed is leaving the city with the five massive keys. Catch him before he escapes. Kill 20 guards for full sync. Well, let's hope that we got the assassins. We are close. Keep steady. Well, well. You have come to see me off. Yeah. Checkpoint reach. up longer than your opponent will deal damage. Alright, awesome. So we took them out. But now, I haven't got any weapons, so I don't know how I'm supposed to take out 20 soldiers. Maybe that's at a later part. Hold on. Oh. Hang on, Sophia. Look out! Again, the same as the beginning. They call the parachute. Oh, that's sick. Are you hurt, Sophia? I don't think so. Hold on. All right. Obviously. How am I gonna assassinate? Protect Sophia. Okay, good. Now, I see them. Assassinate. Assassinate. Use ex assassinate or beat to throw enemies. Okay. Let's throw you. Wait, how are we going to throw him? <laughs> she just took out the no, market stall. Steal yourself, Sophia. More soldiers. Okay. <laughs> okay. So Sophia's health is still looks like it's going alright. Ah, oh, those are farmers. So checkpoint reached. Austin. Oh no, uh, I gotta be more careful. Oh, trees! If I take one more hit, I reckon I'm done for. Alright, let's just navigate through here. What are you doing? Oh! No, 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 no. Oh, okay. That's cool. I was trying to use the wheel before, but it wouldn't let me, so it's good that we can now. Oh, no, 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 Pretty cool. It 
Alright, so her health is getting pretty low. Objective completed. Awesome. Okay. So let's just take down as many guards as we can now. Surely this chase isn't going to go on for much longer. Hey, it's your look. What am I looking at? You have been a thorn in my side. Oh no. Wow. Go ahead, you I'm fine. Get it. Yes. Hold, uh, right trigger to defend. I'm holding. Smack him. Smack him. Come on. Oh, he's hanging on to me. Kick him off, Ezio. Alright, sweet. We're gonna have a showdown. Please tell me there's a showdown. Where? Well, there's the keys. So what now, Ezio? How does this end? I am wondering that myself. Oh, snap. Oh. Is that the brother? Soldiers! Selim is not your master! You serve the Sultan! You carry out his command alone! Where is he? Where is the Sultan? He stands before you, brother. Father made his choice. Ah. Uh. <coughs> Selim! Stop! Please! Ah! Sheesh. Didn't expect that. I thought we were going to have a showdown. So, you are the assassin. It's your auditore. I am Selim, Suleiman's father. He speaks quite highly of you. He is a remarkable boy with a magnificent mind. Were it not for his endorsement, I would have you killed where you stand. Leave this place. Do not return. They so were not friends? <laughs> I you thought we were going to be right friends. Thing, this is not your fight. But where does one end and the next begin? Yeah, like where does that guy's allegiances lie? That looks like it's the end of the eighth sequence. That's pretty cool, playing with the, the that that last mission there with the with the cart and the parachute. Bill, good to see you. Something different. Listen, we've got a customs officer waiting to talk to everyone. I hope you have something for us. Absolutely. Passports and papers for everyone. Ah, brilliant. So I'm... I'm what? A neurosurgeon now, am I? You're a medical team from SUNY Upstate. Just back from Rome with your patient. Experimental gene therapy. Good work. Let's get this over with. Wait, look. This is crazy. What's wrong? I'm not sure, but Desmond's brain is lighting up like a string of firecrackers. Is that his mind shattering? Here it comes. What is that? What's going on? 
This is the end, Desmond. Scheduled for deletion. What are you doing? What is a man but the sum of his memories? We are the stories we live, the tales we tell ourselves. Don't do this. I'm saving you, idiot. Go! Go! It's all crumbling, it's all coming down. I write these lines with a steady hand and a light heart. We are in Ak right now, Sophia and I, with the five Masyaf keys in our possession and all the time in the world. Sophia is a seasoned traveler and a fine companion to have so far from home. Tomorrow we will make our way to Masyaf, and once there, into Altair's library, to fulfill our father's forgotten dream. Forgive the shortness of this letter, dear sister, for it is late, and we are tired. Perhaps, with luck, the next words you hear from me will be in person. Con affetto, Ezio. Okay, so it looks as though we're back at Masyaf. With Sophia. A homecoming. Ezio and Sophia have arrived at Masyaf after many weeks of travel. Time to open the library. So this is going to mark the start of the ninth sequence, I believe, with this story here, which means that we are now at the end game. We're now towards the end of the story, both exciting and sad at the same time. Such a climb. Let's do it faster. This is where your order began? It began thousands of years ago, but here it was reborn. By the man you mentioned, Altair? Altair ibn Laahad. He built us up. Altair us ibn Laahad. He saw the folly of keeping a castle like this. It had become a symbol of arrogance and a beacon for all our enemies. And the mandate for menacing hoods? Was that his idea as well? <laughs> you mentioned a creed before. What is it? Nothing is true. Everything is permitted. That is rather cynical. It would be if it were doctrine, but it is merely an observation of the nature of reality. To say that nothing is true is to realize that the foundations of society are fragile, and that we must be the shepherds of our own civilization. To say that everything is permitted is to understand that we are the architects of our actions, and that we must live with their consequences, whether glorious or tragic. Do you regret your decision? to leave as an assassin for so long. But before we go through that door... I do not remember making that decision. This life... It chose me. For this must be decades, the ruins. I have served the memory of my father and my brothers. And fought for those who have suffered the pain of injustice. I do not regret those years. But it is time to live for myself and let them go. To let go of all of this. Oh man. Alright. Walk with Sophia to the library door. Then let go. You will not fall far. So this is where we started in the beginning of the game. The end of the road.
Use the MAFF keys to complete the puzzle and, un and unlock the library door. What do you hope to find behind that door? Knowledge, above all else. Altair was a profound man and a prolific writer. He built this place as a repository for all his wisdom. He saw many things in his life. What do you hope to find behind that door? Knowledge, above all else. Altair was a profound man and a prolific writer. He built this place as a repository for all his wisdom. He saw many things in his life and learned many secrets, both troubling and strange. Knowledge that would drive lesser men to despair. Ah, okay. Does that worry you? Well, let's have a look. Sophia, you should know by now that I am not a lesser man. Ezio. I think I got it. You had better come out of here. I plan to. Let's see what's in the library. Explore Altair's library. Man, this is going to be sweet. Lighting up the way. Oh, look, you can see it in the distance. Jeez. Look at this. There's like a council in the middle. Look at all these shelves, they're all barren though. At least these ones here are. No books. No wisdom. Just you, fratello mio. Is that Altair? Requiescat in pace, Altair. That's a sixth key. Let's see what this memory is going to be about. It's probably his final days. You have seen to my books. Yes. Some we sent with the Polos. The rest will go with me to Alexandria. Good. Very good. Father, I do not understand. Why did you build a library if you did not intend to keep your books? You should go. When the Mongols return, Masyaf must be empty. I see. This is not a library at all. It is a vault. It must stay hidden, Darim. Far from eager hands. At least until it has passed on the secret it contains. What secret? Go, son. Go be with your family. And live well. All that is good in me began with you, father. Oh, man. He's gonna lock himself inside the vault with what I can only assume is probably the apple of Eden in his hand in that container. In much wisdom is much grief. Yeah. He that increaseth knowledge increaseth sorrow. What does it tell you? What do you see? Strange visions and messages of ones who came before, of their rise and their fall. Altair's goodbye, huh? He's turning off the but lights. What happens to us, Altair? To our family? What does the apple say? Who 
who were the ones who came before? What brought them here? How long ago? Get rid of that thing! This is my duty, Maria. Ah, uh, he's talking to his wife. If you are asked, say I sent the apple away. Tell them I sent it to Cyprus or Sipango or that I dropped it into the sea. Tell them anything to keep men away from this place. This apple must not be found. Not until the time is right. Sit a moment and rest. It's gonna be his final resting place. Over 90 years old. That just gave me the chills. <laughs> That's six keys now. There was one more final one with Altair. Find Altair's Apple of Eden. Another artifact. Stay here. I have seen enough for one life. Oh, Desmond? He's talking to me? I heard your name once before, Desmond. A long time ago. And now it lingers in my mind like an image from an old dream. I do not know where you are. Or by what means you can hear me. But I know you are listening. Oh, what chills all over. What's happening? Why is he taking off all his weaponry? I have lived my life as best I could. Not knowing its purpose. But drawn forward like a moth to a distant moon. And here at last, I discover a strange truth. That I am only a conduit for a message that eludes my understanding. Who are we who have been so blessed to share our stories like this? To speak across centuries? Maybe you will answer all the questions I have asked. Maybe you will be the one to make all this suffering worth something in the end. Now, oh. listen. That must be from the power of the apple. Do you hear me, Cypher? Can you see me? Ah, there you are. Good. A strange place, this nexus of time. I am not used to the calculations. That has always been Minerva's domain. I see you still have many questions. Who were we? What became of us? What do we desire of you? You will have your answers. Only listen, and I will tell you how. Both before the end and after, we sought to save the world. 
We built vaults within which to work, each dedicated to a different method of salvation. They were placed underground to avoid the war which raged above, and also as a precaution should we fail in our efforts. Each vault's knowledge was transmitted to a single place. It was our duty, mine, Minerva's, and Juno's, to sort and sample all that was collected. We chose those solutions which held the most promise and devoted ourselves to testing their merits. Six we tried in succession, each more encouraging than the last, but none worked. And then the world ended. So I assume that there's some sort of music track over this scene. So I apologize that that's not here, but copyright reasons, we had to mute all the music in the videos. Oh wow, it looks like some sort of advanced civilization. Is that the power of the apple that's causing the destruction? The whole place is destroyed. It's a planet. But we carried on together to rebuild, to renew. Listen, you must go there to the place where we labored, labored and lost. Take my words, pass them from your head into your hands. That is how you will open the way. But be warned, much still remains in flux. And I do not know how things... will end either in my time or yours. Wait, look, his vitals are stabilizing. Something's happening. He's, he's moving. Desmond, can you hear me? Son? Oh. I know what we need to do. And it looks like that sequence nine complete and the end of the game. Alrighty guys, 
so that marks the end of the story for Assassin's Creed Revelations. What an amazing game. I thought Brotherhood was great. But this is also a fantastic game. And that marks the end of the uh, trilogy for Ezio. So I'm very excited to see what's going to happen in the next game. Now, the next one is Assassin's Creed 3. Um, which the historical timeline completely changes. It even changes from being around like the European and Caucasus region into America. So it takes place during the American Revolution, uh, Revolutionary War in the 18th century. And I'm pretty excited to see what's going to happen there. I'm excited to see if Desmond's still going to be the... Um, the yeah the 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 out of animus character that they use to to reference back into history or if it's going to be a new person um i'm interested to see who the new assassin is going to be and yeah i guess i will catch you guys on that video don't forget to like and comment um let me know below in the comments what you enjoyed about this series what you may have done differently um that would mean a lot to me, guys. Yeah, so thanks for watching. And I'll catch you on part one of Assassin's Creed 3 in the next video.